something. I can feel it. Captain Kenway? What is the assassin, Dunka Walpole? Dead and buried. After he tried to kill me. We are not sorry to see him gone. But it was you who carried out his final betrayal. Why? Money was my only aim. Should I find comfort in that? You murdered our brothers and sisters in Havana. He has the sense, mentor. James tells me you treated with the Templars there. Did you see the man they called the Sage? Aye. Would you recognize his face if you saw it again? I reckon so. I must be certain. Not a word. Come on. You walked me blind and backwards into this mess, kid. Who the hell was that jester back there? Atabai. An assassin. And my mentor. So you're all part of some daffy religion? We're assassins and we follow a creed, aye. But it does not command us to act or submit, only to be wise. Oh, do tell. I'd love to hear it. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. This is the world's only certainty. Everything is permitted. I like the sound of that. Thinking what I like and acting how I please. You parrot the... Ah! The way forward's blocked. That's a door, I reckon. Aye. And there should be some way to open it. <laughs> like a capstan. Those blocks up there. Try moving then. So it's you lot them Templars have been chasing then. Until you came along and mucked things up, it was us chasing them. We had them running scared. They have the upper hand now. The door's mechanism seems to be broke. Let's find another way around. Follow on, man. Jump! Enough to curse you with, kid! Great treasure beyond. Treasure? Right. Whatever's waiting at the end of this path had better be worth my time. That'll depend on you. How's that? What I'm taking you to see may spin your head right round. I only hope you can take the shock of it. I can handle myself.
this it, then? The grand prize your mentor asked me to see looks nothing like the man they called the Sage, I'm sorry to say. Keep your trousers tied up. With one more riddle to solve. These statues are like the ones we've seen before. With pictures carved on them. There's pictures carved on the floor as well, but not of the same sort. There's a correspondence there. But what? your correspondence. Match a predator with his prey. Jesus, that's him, the sage. But this thing must be hundreds of years old. Older still. You're certain it's him? Aye. It's the eyes that mark him. Did the Templars say why they wanted this sage? They drew some of his blood into this small glass cube. Like this one? Aye. They meant to ask him about the observatory too, but he escaped. Huh. We're finished here. What the hell did I just see back there? Jim! Quiet. The statue in the temple. Was that the man you saw in Havana? Spitting likeness, I. 
It seems another sage has been found. The race for the observatory begins anew. Is that why we're whispering? This is your doing, Captain Kenway. The maps you sold to the Templars have led them straight to us. And now the agents of two empires know exactly where we operate. Leave this to me, Mentor. They have taken Edward's crew as well. I wonder what their lives are worth to him. Take this. You'll attract no attention, and take fewer lives. Use them darts on this one coming now. Quick! Quiet and effective, see? Jade and the like. Oh, silage. Touch pahej, ye tell Winico Mac Abed Kachi. That's to be, don't it? They're pulling it out of the ground, aren't they? Many thanks, but no forgiveness. Here's Captain. Hold you! Slain the core of Celestial. It was a slaver who brought these soldiers. Lawrence Prince himself. Plague and perish if this ever happens again. Among men, can they? Can't handle the Christian. I may thank you later if you manage to live through this. Oh! <laughs> 
Christ. What a mess, eh? Thanks, brother. Out of kindness, you do this or give. Who's out there? See that mangy old codger? He's a Dutch slaver called Lauren's Prince, living now like a king in Jamaica. Bastard's been a target for years. Bloody hell, we nearly had him. By God, you bravos are a cheery bunch, eh? All frowns and furrowed brows. Captain Kenway. You have remarkable skills. Oh, thanks, mate. It comes natural. But you're churlish and arrogant, prancing around in a uniform that you have not earned. Everything is permitted. Isn't that your motto? I absolve you of your errors in Havana and elsewhere. But you are not welcome here. Sorry, mate. Wish it were otherwise. Cheery bunch of mates you've got. You deserve scorn, Edward. Prancing about like one of us, bringing shame to our cause. And what is that? Your cause? To be blunt, we kill people. Templars and their associates. Folks who'd like to control all the empires on Earth. Claiming it's in the name of peace and order. Sounds like to cast his dying words. You see? It's about power, really. About lording over people. Robbing us of liberty. That another message from one of your friends? Aye. I'll show you. <laughs> <laughs> 